Hey everybody, welcome back to Video Geek Squad. And in this video, I wanted to show you how to capture video using Snagit. Snagit is a tool that I use that sort of works within my video recording ecosystem. And it's what I use to capture video as well as images and all sorts of things with this particular uh, software. But for the sake of this particular video, we're just gonna be focusing on uh, capturing a video using Snagit. Now, what you will typically do is you will launch the Snagit tool and you'll simply launch the tool. And when you launch the tool, what will, what will typically come up first will be uh, this little dialog box here. Okay, this says all in one. So this is depending on what you want to do. Um, you have an image. Um, you also have video capture and you can also have some presets here that you set, you know, that you can always use that you can just click on and that will automatically record it with the presets that you set. But for the sake of this video, I just wanted to pretty much show you how to capture video using uh, snag it. Now, what you're going to do is this big red button here is what you are going to hit. Now, I'm going to go ahead and open up my Google screen here. And I'm going to open open this up here and we're going to go to, let's just go to Google, make it easy for us. You know what we'll do? We'll go to msn.com. Let's go to msn. Okay. Um, and so what you'll do is, let me get rid of this. You will launch your video recorder. Okay. The video recorder is what you're going to launch and you're going to press this to capture the video. Okay. And when you press capture for the video, it's going to give you these little outlines that you can use to capture the video. And it's going to give you, you can either do that or you can, you know, make it a little bit smaller. It's going to start creating a, a region for you to do. Uh, to select. Now what I'm going to do since I had it on a window, I'm going to do region so you can see the outline box actually a little bit better here. All right. So what you can do is you can actually set it for a region, right? And so you can set it for a region or you can set it for a window or you can set it for anything specific that you want to do. And then once you see that, then you can uh, hit the record button and the record button will typically be and look something like this and you will either press record. Now this is to keep your uh, webcam on or off. You can turn your webcam on or off and this is how you would launch it. Now I'm using two screens and because I'm using two different screens, I can actually launch it a little bit differently. Okay. And so that's how you would do that. Or you can uh, do a window and you can specify which window you want to do. And you can also share it um, if you're creating a, um, a video and you're in the process and you needed to record another section or something like this, you can automatically share it to like Camtasia, Dropbox, Google Drive, YouTube, all sorts of things. And I normally would share it to Camtasia because that's normally how my workflow is and that's typically how I work. So that's how you actually record a video using Snagit. All right. So please make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Please make sure that you subscribe to the channel if you like little tutorials tutorials like this. And if you have not yet picked up Snagit, please make sure that you look for the dis in the link for the link in the description below. And I would appreciate it if you would use that. It doesn't cost you anything extra and it helps me to continue to make great videos like this. This is how you record video using Snagit and I'll see you in the next video.